Greetings and salutations, my dear brothers and sisters. Welcome to the 30th Annual Gathering of Nations Powwow. As some of you may know, last year I had the pleasure of visiting and working with many great people and with many great tribes and nations. And never before have I undergone such a warm and valuable working experience. The many people I was fortunate enough to meet filled me with such a sense of pride toward my own ancestry, your ancestry, our ancestry. And I learned so much that indeed I received so much in being adopted by the Comanche Nation under the guidance of my amazing Comanche peer, the beautiful LaDonna Vida Tabitite Harris, and of course the late chairman Johnny Wakwa. It is also an honor, unlike any I've ever known, to spend time with the new chairman, Wallace Coffey, the brilliant William Volker, and of course Troy from Sia. With the inhabitants of Canyon de Chey and Monument Valley in the Navajo Nation, to spend time with the people of Moab, Utah, Santa Fe, Angel Fire, Laguna, and Jemez Pueblos in New Mexico, and to all the wonderful and amazing people of Lancaster, Acton, Arcadia, Lone Pine, California. To have spent time with these people, to have spent time upon their lands, was a privilege unlike any other. I felt truly blessed by some strange and unknown force. I'm also very regretful that I am not able to share this weekend with you, to meet with many other incredible people, tribes, and nations that I have yet to encounter. But I know that our time will come soon. Until then, I want you to all know that I am there with you all in both spirit and soul, always. I salute and I serve you all, all Indian peoples, all Indian tribes and nations. You have my eternal respect and I wish you a great, wonderful weekend and a triumphant powwow. Uda, thank you. <laughs>